Hello students, welcome to your channel. Please like, share and subscribe your own channel, School Studies. School Studies is pleased to announce the launch of our educational website, Patel Section. After years of hard work and dedication, we are delighted to officially announce the launch. Our goal with this website is to provide our students with an easier way to learn the lesson and prepare for exams. Today we will see a video related to GSEB Solution Class 9 Social Science Chapter 16 Climate Question 2. Question 1 we have already discussed in our previous video. If you want you can subscribe my channel and go through the video. Today let's say question 2. Question 2 is answer the following questions as directed. The first one is what changes occur with the increase in altitude from sea level. So, as we go higher from the sea level, air pressure and air temperature decrease. Moist air cools down when it rises and air rain occurs. With increasing altitude of the mountains, the rainfall increases. Due to the high altitude, the Himalayan peaks remain covered with snow throughout the year. Sorry, the spelling of snow is wrong. It is S-N-O-W. So, snow throughout the year. Now, what is meant by October heat? So, during October-November, a season of dry and cold wind starts instead of hot summer. Clear sky and increasing temperatures are main characteristics of retreating monsoon winds. Soil contains moisture, day temperature increases, night is cool and pleasant. Daytime weather is very expensive, expensive due to the high temperature and humidity. This situation is known as October heat. It is locally known as Bhadravi Tap. Over which region do the monsoon winds coming over from Bay of Bengal give rain? So the west monsoon winds contain maximum moisture first enters West Bengal and then reaches up to Meghalaya. There the slopes of Garo Kashi and Janitai hills receive heavy rainfall. Winds here deflect and blow from southeast. They cross over West Bengal, Bihar, Uttar Pradesh, Punjab and reach Haryana. Their moist contain decreases as it advances further. Both these currents coming from Arabian Sea to Bay of Bengal merged giving good amount of rain in northern Himalayan region. Snowfall occurs there occasionally. Which phenomena of faraway regions affect Indian climate? So sometimes a peninsula phenomena takes place over places located at far off places from India which creates temporary changes in the long term climate pattern. Phenomena like jet stream, western disturbance, even Nino, ITCZ have affected the Indian climate to a great extent. Jet stream, that is jet winds, blow over the southern slopes of the Himalayas during winter and in summer. These are stationed over peninsula India. High altitude winds bring, help to bring rain. Western dips disturbance often cause disturbance in the pleasant winter weather of North India. Very high mountains receive snowfalls and plains receive some rain which is useful to rabi crop. With this may cause unseasonal rain in Gujarat which may damage crops. The A E L Nino phenomena takes place occasionally. Whenever it takes place, changes occur in the duration of monsoons and amount of rainfall in India. ITCZ is be it is becomes stable over Ganga plains in July. Due to the low pressure developed over this region, winds generated over the oceans in Southern hem Hemisphere blows towards this area. It causes rain in a few parts of North India. So this was question 2 of GSEB solution for class 9th Social Science Chapter 16. I hope you like my video. Thanks for watching my video. Thank you. Please leave comment, question or doubts in comment section if you have any or you can drop a mail to us. You will find my email ID at the end of this video. You can also join us on Facebook page, follow us on Instagram, connect us on LinkedIn or tweet us on Twitter. Thanks for watching my video. Thank you.